Hello everybody, this is C Gaming, Chaos Carlo and Cynical Cloud here. Today we're gonna to be showing you how to find all the skulls on Halo Combat Evolve. So Cloud, where's the first skull? Alright, so we're gonna be starting off with mission one, the pillar of autumn. Once you get out of this um cryo tube here, you're gonna to wanna to go around it and go behind these containers. And you find your first skull. Real simple. Just walk over and you'll pick it up. It'll say Iron Skull Unlocked. And you should get an achievement. Now keep in mind that you have to be playing on the remastered version of Halo Combat Evolved in order to get it. Right? So let's go on to the skull number two. Alright. Let's move along. We are on mission two called Halo. Keep in mind that there are two skulls in this mission. So... Let's go get the first skull. After exiting the lifeboat, walk towards the waterfall that is in the distance. Slightly stay to the right. So the skull is behind that big rock over there. Yeah, that big rock right there. That is the mythic skull. Alright, let's go get skull number three. So right after the warhog is dropped off, head towards the tunnel. But do not go inside the tunnel. Instead, use the ledge on top of it. Then use that ledge to go to the skull. And that is the Boom Skull. Alright, now for the Foreign Skull. We are on the Truth and Reconciliation. You have to push your way through the mission until you get to this room right here where I am at. You can tell that you're there because of that edge that I am aiming at right now. So what you do is you have to kill all of the Covenant that come through out this area until the very end. Now there is a door on the right hand side where you have to be at when two hunters come out of there. The door does close right after they come out so you have to be there in order to get inside before the door closes. So what you do is fight everybody and go through it which I'm going to skip ahead until they do come out but this is the door that you're going to want to look for right in front of me. Alright as I pick off these last few Covenant you're going to be able to tell that the hunters are about to come out of this room by a theme song that pops out whenever you're fighting hunters. Just make sure you pay attention to that and then once the door opens just run towards it, jump over them if you have to go around them, but get inside of that room and go left and you will see the foreigner skull on the ground. Alright, let's go get the next skull. We are on the mission called Silent Cartographer. There are two skulls in this mission. First up is the Famine Skull. So right after you jump off the pelican, make it left and start walking. When you see the cliff, get on top of it and head towards the peak and you should see the skull. That was the Famine Skull. Next up is the Bandana Skull. This skull is located at the control room. When you get there, make a left and you should see a ledge. You have to grenade jump. It may be a little difficult as it took us a while. But once you're up there, look at the wall and you should see the skull.
And that was the bandana skull. Alright, welcome back. We are on the salt on the control room getting the fog skull number seven. So we are at the first elevator that you get to and we are headed down. Now we took the liberty of going ahead and killing everybody. That way we don't waste time and we could show you exactly where the skull is. Be warned, this is another grenade jump in order to get this skull. It's gonna probably take us several tries, so don't like get discouraged if you don't do it on the first try because it didn't take it didn't take us just one try either but by the power of editing you know we got it the first try right carlo exactly <laughs> all right so this is the room you're going to want to look for this is the steam right here the skull is actually up in this room up there now we found it the best way to get it actually because we tried everywhere but the best place to get it is on this little tiny ledge over here all right, once you make it on this ledge up here, this is the pillar you're gonna want to jump on, but in order to reach it, you have to grenade jump, just like Carlo is about to show you right now. Just be careful not to stick yourself. All right, so, my turn. All right, and this is the fox call. Let's move on to the next skull. All right, welcome back. This is still Assault on the Control Room. We are headed towards the Malfunction Skull. So head through this door that you just recently opened. You're gonna look for two bridges in this room called the Chasm Room. There's one bridge on the left and one bridge on the right. Head towards the bridge on the right. Once you get here, get off of the Warthog and there's going to be a little pillar thing sticking out down here and you see the skull from up here so just jump down and grab it all right we'll see you for the next skull all right let's go get skull number nine recession we are on the mission called 343 guilty spark so please Pay very close attention to where we're going because it's easy to get lost in this mission. We were planning to skip ahead until we got to the skull, but in order for you not to get confused on where you need to go, we decided to keep the video length the way it was that we could follow our every move. So just pay attention real closely and you'll be able to get there um, simply as we got there. So after crossing this log, stay to the left of this ledge. And then just follow the ledge until you can go no further. All right, from here, look down and the skull is between these two trees. That was skull number nine, recession. All right, welcome back. We are on the library getting the black eye skull. Okay, we spawned it from over there, which is the beginning of this mission, but we pushed our way through over here. That way we could kill all of the flood. That way they don't get in the way. Now, a couple things that you're going to need to know is one, do not waste any of your grenades at all because you're going to need them all. Two, make sure that you have full life. So if you don't and you have a partner like I do, just make sure he kills you and you get all your stuff back and you get your full life back. Okay. So this is a door that 343 Guilty Spark wants you to go through, but don't go through it. Instead, turn around to the left and look at this vent right here. That's where the skull is located at. You're going to have to grenade jump onto this ledge right here and then jump over there. So Carlos is going to show you how it's done. Let's go. All right, there you go. All right, once you make it up on this pillar, you're going to have to jump from here to that vent right there. Okay, now make your way up a little bit. Turn on your flashlight, and the skull is right here. This is the black eye skull. All right, so 
let's go get the next skull. All right, now for the eye patch skull that is located on the library, which is still the mission we are on. It is located at the end of the mission when you walk into the index room. Don't go towards the index. Instead, right before you do, make a right. You're going to see that this room is circular. All you have to do is follow it around to the corner, left-hand side, all the way around until you get to the skull. I'm going to go ahead and skip ahead. All right, now that we've reached the end, you'll be able to see the skull right in front of you. Just walk over it and claim the eye patch skull. Now let's move on to the next skull. Welcome back. We are on the mission Two Betrayals. We are going after skull number 12, Piñata or Piñata. So we came out of this tunnel and the skull is up this tunnel on top of it. So in order to get there, we'll need some banshees. So, you know, we took the liberty of just killing some enemies in front of us. We grabbed these goals, you know. And then, yeah, we, we just making our way to the Banshee. So. You gotta just... hang in there because it's gonna be a long ride to get this Banshee and then come back. Yes, and fight enemies along the way. So, I'll go up here first. Woohoo! Success. Come on. Alright, good job, good job. Thank All you. Right. Alright, we are close to the Banshees from here. What we're gonna do is just kill any enemies up ahead because they are a pain in the butt to deal with, especially the Wraiths. So, what the best option to do here is just kill any enemies because they will destroy any your Banshees. So, just what we're gonna do is just kill the enemies and, you know, slowly make our progress to getting the banshees so yeah we're killing killing shooting awesome moves fast and furious all that you know awesomeness all right i'm gonna throw a rocket at the wraith right there Left if you side have a partner turn. all right cool cool if you have a partner it is extremely helpful when you're playing with a partner so if you can have a partner then i highly recommend you play with a partner and on easy or normal yeah you do not want to be doing this on legendary especially you will, not you will go nowhere near these all right oh so yeah second race is down all right i'm on the banshee let's go carlo all right, I'm going. I'm making my way over there. All right, I'm about to... I'm on the Banshee. I'm making my move. All right, you're behind me? I am. All right. So from here, all you have to do is just go back to the tunnel that you came from. So, we're flying... Enjoying Fine. this move. Enjoying this move. Oh, smooth. Smooth. Move. Yeah. It's and relaxing. then we are close to getting the 12th skull. All right. About to drop in in some safe landing. Oh, gonna park my Lamborghini. <laughs> This is my G5. And here is skull number 12. Piñata. Piñata Slash skull. Piñata. <laughs> yeah. Alright. Let's go get the next skull. Welcome back. We are on the mission The Ma. We're going after skull number 13. Grunt birthday party. This skull is located where Full Hammer has to pick you up. As you can see, the skull is in the right side. So, in order to get that skull, you have to use this Warhog, then jump on top of it, and use this Warhog to get on the pipe. Then we go after this last skull. That, you guys, is the Grunt Birthday Party Skull. This is C Gaming. We're out.